and I'm Mimi. Last vlog, I made Snowskin Mooncake or Mochi Mooncake. For this time, I decided to make Mochi. So what's Mochi? Mochi is a Japanese rice cake made of glutinous rice, pounded into paste, and molded into round shape or square pieces. Japanese thought that the power of rice can be made purer by pounding and mochi was believed to contain the spirit of rice. Traditionally, mochi is eaten plain or filled with red bean paste. But I love creamy egg fillings. So for the filling of the mochi I'll make, I'll try to go for a custard. Stay tuned with me on how to do it. Let's head to the kitchen! First, we make the mochi dough in a small bowl, combine 2 tablespoons of green tea powder with 4 teaspoons of water. Stir the mixture until homogeneous. In another bowl, combine 1 cup of machiko flour and 3 fourth cups of water. Whisk well until there is no lump. mixture for 10 minutes. While waiting, we can prepare the custard filling. Bring out the frozen custard and take a portion of the paste into your hands. Roll each third into a ball. Time's up! Steaming is done! You can check if the dough is cooked using a spoon. Now mix the mochi dough and scrape it off from the bowl. Add in the matcha mixture. Mix it evenly of your desired color. For this one, I wanted it with a light shade of green. Now let's assemble the mochi. Spread the cornstarch generously on a cutting board. Transfer the mochi dough on top of the starch. Sprinkle more starch on top of the mochi dough and on your hands, or else it will be sticky. Wow, so chewy! Use a dough scraper to divide the mochi into equal pieces. Flatten the dough into a circle shape. Place a ball of frozen custard in the center of the dough. Bring all four corners of the dough over the ball. Then bring the rest of the edges to the top and pinch the seam line by pulling the mochi dough. Once closed, roll the mochi on your palm a few times to reshape.
Repeat the same procedures for the next portions of mochi dough. Here is a green tea mochi with custard filling you made for today. I highly recommend you guys to serve mochi at room temperature. It goes well with green tea or hojicha in Japanese. The mochi will stay fresh for up to 2 to 3 days but it's best to consume on the same day. I hope you guys enjoy this timeless Japanese sweet for all ages. Try this easy recipe now! In Japan, mochi is traditionally made in a ceremony called machitsuki. The preparation of mochi requires two persons where they pound and turn it. But what I did here is just a simple homemade recipe and you guys can try it. In my next cooking vlog, I'll be demonstrating on how to make custard with just six simple ingredients. Thanks for watching! Like and subscribe to watch out for my next vlog.